Welcome to this section on rethinking temptations. In this section, we are going to cover a new bank of strategies you can use in order to exert better self-control and commit to your long-term goals. So if you remember from earlier in the course, we talked about how self-control conflict is about the conflict between a short-term temptation and a long-term goal. In general, that's what the conflict is. You want to pursue your long-term goal, but you also want something about this short-term temptation. And if you give into the temptation, it goes against your long-term goal. But if you commit to the long-term goal, that means that you don't necessarily get the short-term pleasure out of the temptation. You are stuck. You are stuck between two things that you really want to commit to and act in accordance with. But it's hard to weigh the benefits and the negative of each things. And we have talked a little bit about how planning in advance can help you maintain your long-term goal, be committed to your long-term goal. Anticipate problems. But what happens if you are sitting there and you see a temptation and you want it so bad? It's just calling you, beckoning to you, eat me, eat me. Just forget about your goal, forget about your weight loss plan. You want me. How do you resist this? So how can you resist? How can you take this thing in front of you and say no? Well, in this section, we are going to talk about strategies where you can think about that temptation differently. And if you reconstruct it, it will be less alluring to you. Reconstruct is this process of seeing something in front of you and thinking about it differently. So if I reconstruct this muffin in a particular way, I can make it so that it's not quite so tempting and I'm more able to overcome the urge to break my long-term goal and cave to this temptation. So in this section, we are going to talk about few strategies for reconstructing or rethinking temptation. One of these is to think more abstractly and we will cover a whole bunch of research that's shown that doing this makes the intentions less attractive and also commits you to something that's a more long-term goal. Then we are going to talk about a simple strategy about avoiding thinking in photos. That will make more sense once we get to it. And then finally, we will think about imagining something else and how if we reconstruct that temptation as being a totally separate different thing. We remove all of the tempting elements of it and to make it easier to resist. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit the subscribe button before you go. If you have any questions, comment below, give me a like and just follow me to don't miss one of my videos on YouTube, Instagram and Facebook. To your success, your health and wealth mentor.